mystery to me how you plan to take over anything without raising a little hell. Don't worry about it. Well, you remember, you're heading up this operation for one reason and one reason only. Because you done made us lots of promises. But I'm warning you, if you don't come up with something right quick... Don't worry. Well, I mean money. We need all that money. We need ourselves a building. And we need it now. We shall have it. Oh, and this place is condemned. And just as long as those new bricks don't get used, it stays condemned. We can always... Uh, I don't it. think we ought to just take this place. I mean, just take no, it. Oh, and listen to me. Listen. I tell you, you and I have got a great opportunity here. The entire Georgia empire, what's left of it, it's all out there in that van. The hardware, the uniforms, all of it. We are in such a position. And I tell you, you can keep a secret. This time tomorrow, I expect to be a happily married homeowner. What? True. Quietly, legally. So there's no need to get gun happy, all right? There's no need to arouse the law until we are the law. Weren't for all that money. I know, all right. Just think of the money and calm yourself. Let's get this open. All right. Let's see, we got papers. Good. Papers. Records, addresses. Ooh, we need these, praise God. Oh boy, howdy, looky here. <laughs> I sure do like me some dynamite. <laughs> Wait, we just drove up the mountain with a box of dynamite? Don't you worry, these is good little babies. They won't go off without no charge. These is good little babies, hee <laughs> All right, well, let's put it back. Back in the van. Betty goes over this place with a toothbrush. I don't wanna have to explain dynamite. Well, say, how come you didn't tell us you was getting married tomorrow? We thought you was getting married in November. Oh, well, Catherine and I just couldn't wait till November. No? No. We're too much in love. Lying sack of shit. <laughs>